Hello, this is Chiron Intuition, and I'm here to do a reading for the collective. It's not going to resonate with everyone, but if it does, take what goes, and please leave what does not. We have chaser. It says, I don't want to chase anymore. Then don't. <laughs> I'm sorry. It says sunglasses. Okay. Sunglasses here. What is this? It says watching, looking, <laughs> stalking. Like, if you don't want to chase no more, stop chasing. It says conversation. Somebody just want to talk to you. It says, I want to call you and hear your voice. I don't want to chase you. I don't want to have to feel like I'm chasing you or I'm after you. Well, that's what you're doing. If you feel like you don't want to chase, then don't. Stop doing it. Stop doing it. Shit. It says sword and rose. Look, clarity and truth. Stop doing it. It says revelation. Somebody want to tell you some shit. They want to set some shit straight. I don't think so. This is somebody that's chasing you. Why are you chasing? Let me get something here with this sword and rose. I need to go somewhere with this right here, man. It says habits. This person does this shit to everybody. This person does this to everybody. Like, damn. Talking about, I don't want to chase no more. Stop chasing. Stop chasing. You got two legs. You can't go here, 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 here. You can't chase everybody. Chase yourself. That's who you should be chasing. Chase God. Okay? It says backstab. And I told you this person do this shit to everybody. Heartbreaking pain. So what's this, what's this person expect? They chasing people with this fucking knife, people running, and they tired of chasing them. So stop chasing them. Let me get something here. It says, I don't know if, if we will ever change, but I be seeing I. I said, I don't know if I will ever change. I don't know about that we. I don't know about that we. Okay. It says camera, reminiscing, making memories, learn from the past, perception. Somebody is like just really stuck in the past probably looking at pictures see all this darkness right here all this black in the background it's like this person i feel like is either depressed they're in a dark time in their life god they probably feel all types of ways right now it says talking interested awaiting messages like they really want to talk like damn why do they want to talk all this darkness i don't like that out of seven cards four of them shouldn't be black Okay, or dark, I should say. For him, look, it's a fucking. It shouldn't be black. It shouldn't be black. It shouldn't be black. No, that's darkness. That's fucking energy transfer. You see the phone call right here. You see her on the phone laughing and shit. But then you got four cards that's black. After that, nah, they could black that shit out over there. Don't bring that shit over here. That's some wild ass shit right there. What I'm seeing right now. This person is on the phone, and then after that, it's just black. It says sword and rose, habits, backstabbing, camera. Like, get out of here with that. Get out of it. Man, this is why I don't even be using Oracle cards so much, because they be getting on my nerves. <laughs> people's true energy. People's true energy, like, really takes the cake for me. Because these are people that do this shit. We have the two of pentacles here. Like this person wants nothing more than to balance some shit out. They want to develop something. They want to keep working on something. Look at this five of sword. I don't think so. I just don't think so. It's a problem here. It's a big problem. You see, it's the swords that I was saying. This person is chasing people with the motherfucking knife. And they're wondering why people keep running from them. Like, then they call people and it's just like, just all, oh my god i'm getting that feeling of like you ever talk to somebody with like really fucking bad breath and it's just it's like that like that's how they get on the phone it's just something darkness just it's just mm, that's how i'm feeling i'm feeling like mm, like you make that face when you smell that shit I'm like mm, mm, mm. i'm telling you it should not be all black after on the phone with this person that means it's an energy transfer they're trying to send that shit to you they're trying to give it to you nah it's like they don't know that they got shit attached to them. They don't know. 
or do they know? I need to know. I don't think this person knows. I think this person is really confused as to why people be running. Okay, we got the four of wands here. This person thinks talking to you will like solve some type of issue. It'll solve some type of problem, but it's really an energy transfer. Like this is some nasty shit. I'm even getting a fire sign. Not that I have any, I don't have any indication out here that's giving me that it's a fire sign, but I just feel that way. It could even be an air sign, but I'm getting a fire sign. Like this is an energy transfer. Okay. You ever had somebody to call you and just fuck up your mood? That's the kind of shit I'm talking about right here, but it's deeper than that. Like it's a, it's not just fucking up your mood. It's like, shit, man, let me get something here. And then it, the talking is the last card right here. Nah, we got the hangman energy. Yeah, something to stall something, to stop something, for you to sacrifice something, for you to let something go, for you to look at something differently because they want to make you feel like you was confused about the shit. You wasn't confused. You was not confused. They was holding that knife and you was running. We have the two of wands energy here. Mm -mm. Please don't answer the phone. Don't answer the door. We have the nine of pentacles here. It's something that they see that you have and that's why they're headed your way or that's why they want to come towards you. Like this is all on the black cards right here. We have the page of pentacles energy here. Wow, it's like they want to try to make it look like they're planting a new seed with you. They're starting something new with you. They want to start something new with you. But really it's about energy transference. It's like they're going to be okay and then what you think you're going to be looking like because you know opposites, okay? Right now, they're not okay, but after they talk to you, they're going to be okay, and then what you going to be looking like. That's what I'm talking about. That's the shit I'm talking about. You see? And this was the first card out. I should have seen it when I first fucking seen it. I didn't even see her necklace, the yin and the yang. She's balancing these things. Look at that energy transference. Look at it. Look at it. <sighs> Get out of here with that. We have death. Yeah. Energy transference. Scorpio energy here. It's something about a cycle that has already ended and they trying to bring it back to, to life. Like you ever seen a flower that's just dead and all shriveled up and then you try to water it? Do you think that that joint is going to come back to life? I don't think so. Maybe some flowers do, but I'm not talking about those kind of flowers. Okay. Y'all know what I'm saying. We have the eight of pentacles here. Eight of pentacles. What are they trying? It's like they want to actually they want to actually do something, grow something, work together, work on something like I don't. It's like they don't see the fundamental problem <laughs> like they don't see it. They just see what they want. And it's like, hello, <laughs> you trying to throw your demons on people. <laughs> I swear to goodness, this shit is so funny to me. It's so not fun, but funny. It's funny to me. Look, Queen of Sword. Like somebody, I don't, mm -mm. don't, don't bring it over here. We got the Three of Sword energy here. Okay. It's something that you could have done alone. It's like they wanted to do it with you or they saw themselves with you or they saw them as like a counterpart to you. But it's like, it's not. It's one of those relationships for real. It's like energy transference. This person uses you or they want to use you to get something out of you. It's, I'm trying to tell you. They want to call you. That's what that Queen of Swords is talking about. She's about communication. She likes to talk. We got the Tower card here. And that's why I'm telling you, don't do it because it's right underneath the Hangman. This is exactly what they want to do. I feel like this person... <laughs> This person might get on my nerves because I just picked up on somebody that they know what they do. They know what they do and they try to be very slick about it. They know they try to make it sound like, you know, it's nothing. Or sometimes they be trying to make it sound like, oh, they're joking or they be trying to. But it's not that kind of energy. It's really the kind of energy like this person uses people to build themselves back up because they don't have no energy. Like they're very depleted. They're very depleted and it's like they look for people. They chase everybody. They look for somebody to call so that they can put all that darkness on them and then they feel better. No, do not fucking call me. No, no. <laughs> That's how I feel about it. No, not, not after I just seen this woman on the phone and then four dark cards. No, 
Do not, because this is exactly what they do. This is exactly what's going to happen. And if you go through it and you're going to see, you're going to see. And when you see for yourself and you realize that that's what this person does, how many more times are you going to let them get away with it? Look, we got the Ten of Pentacles here. This is all they want. It's something where it's an energy exchange. Ugh, they need your energy in order for them to be in a better energy. They need your energy for them to be in a better energy. And if they have no outlets, when I tell you they will fucking self-destruct, it'll just become a ball of darkness if they have nobody to throw their darkness onto. Nah, don't let them mess up your energy, your money, what you're building. Don't let them do that. The tower and then the ten of pentacles. I don't think so. I don't think so. That's like some letting somebody in your house and they burn your whole shit down. When you knew you shouldn't have let them in your house. When you knew this person is a damn pyromaniac or some shit. I don't know. Shit. <laughs> Y'all know what I'm saying. It's analogy, okay? We have the Knight of Swords energy here. Once again, they need to go away with these swords. I'm not feeling these swords in this reading. I'm not feeling these swords. Don't call me. Don't text me. Don't email. Uh-uh. Don't put none of that darkness over here. Somebody here, that's their target. You see it? It's facing. He's facing. He's coming with the sword. He's facing. He's like, nah, I got to get some of that. I got to get some of that because I feel like shit right now. I feel like this that and the third and i know i could call this person up and i can say this and do that and i'm gonna feel a whole bunch better and this person won't even know what i did yeah it's one of those it's one of those let me get something here and we don't have a lot of major arcana we got scorpio we got pisces and we got the tower card which is like mars look we got the ace of pentacles here it's something they want from you Man, when I tell you they want this shit from you, that's the only thing that's on their mind. They feel like they feel like it has to come from you or something like that. Like, like no type of how can I say this person is not paying attention to God. They're not paying attention to what like whatever it is that's before them or whatever they got to start. They're not looking at that. They don't want this. They want this. They want what's already grown. They don't want the fucking seed. OK, they want the motherfucking fruit. They don't want to wait for the damn seed to grow. They want the fruit. They hungry right now. You know how long fucking seeds take to grow? Huh? You know how long it takes to build a business? You know how long it takes to build any type of anything that you work hard on and you perfect it? That shit doesn't happen in a day. Anybody that's ever worked on anything, it took them a long time to get to a place where they were like their work was dependable. It took a long fucking time. Don't nobody have this person right here. They don't have time for that. This, they don't have time for that. They have time for this. Okay? I'm telling you. I'm telling you, this is the kind of energy that we're looking at. I really do feel like this is a person that knows exactly what the fuck they do. They know exactly. Because if, if this is a person that does not know what they do, then yeah, they probably sitting in the corner crying somewhere wondering why everybody runs from them. Okay? But if this is the person that I think it is, this is a person that really does understand what they do. And they need those outlets or they know they're not going to be okay. They can't be okay by themselves because they have too many demons. All these fucking black cards. Let me get something here with this damn death card. <sighs> Lord, we have the queen of sword. I told you. And I knew she was going to come out. This is her wanting to talk or him wanting to talk. But it's like, I don't even want to hear it. Like you ever talk to somebody? It's like, I can't even listen to you. I can't fucking, I can't listen to you. I can't hear another word that you say because what you are talking about, I cannot. I don't want to hear it. It's distorted. It's twisted. And it's fucking up my day. You get what I'm saying? It's giving me that. It's giving me that. Don't call me with that. Godly. Let me get something here with this. This person is searching for somebody to give it to. Searching for somebody to give their darkness to. Shit. And for some people, maybe they don't know that they have fucking darkness and they be giving that shit to people. Maybe they don't know. Maybe it's a few people out there that they're just very oblivious to the fact that they got a lot of shit with them. OK. And you got a lot of baggage and shit and you be putting it on other people. And it's not right. It's not right. It's like this is like, oh, and I'm not talking about like your normal, normal. This is like the kiss of death is what I'm fucking talking about. OK, that's what I'm talking about. I'm not talking about no normal shit like, oh, somebody just have a little problem. or nothing. No, I'm talking about when they lay that shit on you, you be tired. 
you be depleted you be probably pissed and mad and all they just leave you in all types of ways and they get off the phone they be good not today nah look not today not today they not crossing this huh we got the fucking block on they not crossing that boundary let me get something here with this nine of wands yeah they definitely gonna try it they definitely gonna try it chasing people so they can put all their damn demons on them and shit like that and it's like damn they about to make my damn neck hurt what is this we got the four of swords energy here Y'all, I'm about to throw the cards. I'm about to throw the cards. You see? This is exactly what's going on. You see somebody protecting their peace? You see somebody healing? And then here's, here she come or he come wanting to fuck that up. I'm trying to tell y'all what I'm seeing here. I'm trying to tell y'all. You got people that do this shit. Everybody got some different shit with them. And this is a person right here. They, they need what you call those. I forget what you call them. Somebody is going to say it in the comments. It's like oh my god it's not dependence it's like oh my god i cannot the word is on the tip of my tongue and i cannot think of it it's like where they need oh my god i cannot wait for somebody to say the word in the comments because it's a very known word and i cannot remember but it's like when someone uses other people to do exactly what I've been explaining right now, it's like they have a whole bunch of those around them where they can, you know, when one person don't want to hear it, you got another person. Or if that person is still depleted from them putting their demons on them, then they got another person. It's something I cannot think of the word. Please, somebody, please, please tell me the word. Tell me the word. Look, we got the Ten of Wands. No, ma'am, we're not going to do that. We're going to protect ourselves from all that energy that they trying to throw on us. We're not going to do that. We shouldn't be walking. Nobody should be looking like this after you talking to this lady or this man. Nobody should be looking like that. If you feeling like this, looking like this, like everything just fell onto you or everything fell onto your shoulders. It's even shit. Pff, child, people. Pff, my God, I can't even say it. People don't even be knowing they got demons on them. People don't even be knowing that they got shit on them that like they be transferring to other people. They don't even know it. They don't even know it. But it's like the, the the energies that are on them, they do what they do. They know because they feed. It's like they they feed something that they don't even know they're feeding. They don't even know. It's like it's different elements. There are certain people that don't know. And, and look, I'm telling the truth. There are certain people that do not know that they have these demons and they do what they do. And they be wondering why people run. There are certain people that know that they have this problem and they need this energy. There are certain people, but they don't know about the demons that are on them. And then there are certain people that are consciously feeding this shit. I don't know who you're dealing with. I don't know who you're dealing with. We have the page of swords energy here. I'm telling you, somebody going to pay attention. Or this is, this is a person that's paying attention to your money. Or they're going to pay attention to how you are or man i'm telling you this is the type of person they want to transfer this shit on you and they want to see this shit on you because then they will know that something has been transferred to you or like it's something that you say like like oh i gotta get off the phone i'm so tired they're gonna be like okay yeah 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 you get what i'm saying child i'm about to throw the cards this is somebody that wants to hear that they love to hear that because that concludes the transaction y'all better get up on the game Y'all better get up on this shit. Y'all better realize there's people out here that do this shit. They don't even know what the fuck they are. It's succubus walking around here. They don't even know. They don't know what they are. It's angels walking around here. They don't know what they are. There's demons walking around here. They don't know what they are. So many people, they don't, they don't know what they are. We just all human up in here, right? What is this here? We have the nine of cups energy here. Yeah, let me get something with this nine of cups because you see what I'm talking about? It's all over the board for me. It's all over the board for me. It is. Don't you see? This is what I've been saying the whole time. You see the ten of wands and then this page of sword and then somebody got the nine of cups. Do you see them sitting pretty after they transfer all that shit to you? I'm not lying about this shit. This shit is right here. It's right here. And if you fall for it, this is what's going to happen to you. And it's like, how do you even it's this is the kind of shit you can't even tell the person why. It's that kind of shit. It's deep like that. Like somebody call you and you be like, nah, man, I really can't talk to you like that because you be transferring your demons over here. So, you know, I got to go. You get what I'm saying? It's it's something where you got to realize it and you got to move accordingly. You got to move accordingly. 
You got to move accordingly. Let me get something here with this before I drop all these cards. Oh my God. Look, and we got the Eight of Swords here. Now they never going to see. I dropped some other cards here too. I can't even reach it. Oh my God. Let me get these cards. See what I done dropped on the floor. Yeah, Two of Swords. Mm -mm. They need to be blocked. You need to walk away from them. Look at that Eight of Cups. You need to go in and go about your business, okay? Preserve your energy is what I just heard. Because this person, if this person can't get it from who they need it from, then they're going to be stuck. Look, they're going to be stuck in their own shit. They're not going to be able to get it. They want to get it from you, though. I'm trying to tell you what I'm seeing. Like, you don't know. You do not know. There's a lot of energy that comes through communication. This whole world, this whole universe is energy. Okay? There's somebody that uses that shit to their benefit. Like, they hide behind the words, the conversation. It's people that can send you shit through the phone if you let them. And it is about like letting somebody in your energy. It's about allowing them. If you allow them, like, you know, somebody knock on your door, you just allow them in your house, but you don't know who the fuck they are. You know how vampires, they have to like, they have to, um, how can I say, be invited in. You think all these folklore and all these stories is for shits and giggles? Okay, let me get something here. Shit, that shit ain't no fucking joke. That shit comes from the world of spirit. All that make-believe shit and all these horror stories and movies and all this shit. <laughs> okay. Okay. We have compassion here. And what is this at the bottom? It says, ask and receive. Lord, nah, this person, I don't like this shit right here. I don't like this shit right here. This is very emotionally manipulative, especially after all of this energy. Nah, it shouldn't be no ask and receive and compassion. You don't get no compassion trying to get your demons over here. You don't get no compassion trying to throw that shit over here with me. You don't know. No, no. We're going to leave this one right here. If you like the way that I read, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much for your likes, shares, and subscribes. I truly appreciate it because it is how we get the messages out in order to elevate the collective. I love you guys, and I'll be back with another reading later. Bye.